Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for April 3rd of 2024 is titled Unusual Nebula PA30. So what do we see here? Well, this is actually a supernova remnant, but almost looks like fireworks in the sky spreading out from a central star. Now, this is actually located at the point in the sky where a star was seen to appear, what we'd call a supernova, back in the year 1181. And since that time, the material has been ex- expanding outward and that's what we're seeing here is the material that expands outward into space. Now this is a very unusual supernova remnant and if you've seen other pictures this actually has things more in common with what we call a nova. A nova occurs when nuclear reactions occur on the surface of a white dwarf star a very compact dead star and then that material explodes outward. Now, a nova itself does not destroy the star and could occur over and over again. It also has some things that look like a planetary nebula. So what do astronomers think might have happened here? Well, it might be a very rare type of supernova, what is called a type 1a x. Now, a supernova of type 1a is a white dwarf star which explodes and it explodes when it gets pushed over its mass limit. The type 1a x occurs when two white dwarfs merge together. And that, of course, also pushes them over their limit. But it's a much different type of explosion than the typical supernova of type 1a that we're used to. So this is thought that this might be the case as to what happened here. Now we see the remnant left at the center and typically in this type of supernova nothing is left behind. So sometimes this is called a zombie star what is left over after the stars died. And so somehow perhaps this remnant was able to survive the explosion or at least some portion of it that was left behind. Now a supernova explosion is more massive than anything we can begin to imagine. A supernova going off within 50 or so light years of Earth would release enough energy to wipe out life on the surface of the planet. Now, there's no stars that could go supernova within that distance. We're quite safe. But that's the amount of energy that we're talking. That even at a distance of many light years, that amount of energy is released. So while we can see a beautiful sight like this in the image and try to learn more about these distant objects, these distant supernovae that do occur. Now, continue to study. Do we understand these completely? That's certainly not the case. Here we're looking at a combination of different wavelengths. We're looking at infrared, visible, and x-ray observations all put together, trying to piece together what might happen in an explosion like this. So that was our picture of the day for April 3rd of 2024. It was titled Unusual Nebula PA30. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.